Sin gorrito no hay cumpleaños. Y sin goma no corre los carros. No. So, el tema que estamos hablando hoy es la palabra stilting. Muchos de ustedes no saben qué diablo significa. Porque yo tampoco sabía lo que significaba. Pero stilting significa el, el acto de quitarte el condón cuando estás en relaciones sexuales con alguien, sin ellos saber. Bárbaro, va a ser... no, so, entonces, que... el Senado de los Estados Unidos tuvo dos personas que dijeron que eso estaba supuesto significarse que es um, violación. Right. Mm. So, ahora vamos a traer el tema a la mesa. Le quiero dar tu primero. Si él me deja, yo lo doy. Yo me yo primero. Y, 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 oye, muchas de las cosas que yo voy a decir, le voy a dar gracias a Emma, porque Emma, Emma se puso en el otro lado. Y, oye, me, no, no me dio una galleta porque tiene grande. Pero ella es mía, ella es mía, ella es mía. Te digo, no es violación de haber been a rape. ¿Me okay. entiendes? Es violación de tu derecho de saber que tú hiciste eso. ¿Tú me entiendes? Ok, ya tú, yo no te estoy violando, pero ya tú me dijiste que tú te lo puedo meter. Ok. Flow, ¿verdad? So okay. that's when the whole rape doesn't apply. Yeah, that, for me, ya yeah, eso elimina rape. Now, now. In, a, in a sense of morals or in a sense of the court of law? ¿Cuál de las dos? To, no. Flow, flow. Estos son flow de Emma, porque fue Emma que me puse en esta. So dale. In, in the court of law, porque ya tú me, tú me estás diciendo a mí okay. que yo te violé. Uh -huh. que yo te obligué y que... Bueno, es que... Eh, la... Ok, dale, dale, dale. Espérate. Hay veces que no, no te no obligan. Hay gente, a veces que las mujeres se frisan y no dicen nada. Uh -huh. Y como quiere violación, porque ella nunca te dijo que sí. Uh -huh. Ya es otro flow. Pero cuando tú estamos ahí, y yo me quedo con no, vamos a decir, y te sigo boom, boom, boom. Sin sí, que ella se cuenta. Sin que ella se cuenta. Para mí, la cosa de violación ahí fue... Tu integridad. Entonces tú me dijiste a mí que estaba haciendo con condón y tú te lo quitaste. Vamos a decir tú me enfermaste. Uh -huh. Yo te puedo demandar. Claro que sí. A flow de que tú no me dijiste a mí que tú te ibas a quitar eso y yo no te dije a ti que te lo quitara. Claro que sí. So, lo que tú violaste ahí fue tu conducta en el momento. Ok. Para mí. Ok. So, si hay una par de leyes bacanas que tú me vas a dar los datos, <risa> tíramela para arriba, ¿me entiendes? La aguanta, todavía hay que tirarla, dale, Jay. Ok, so yo personalmente pienso, eh, el que... It, I, it's not considered rape, and I believe, and I believe this thoroughly for the simple fact that once there is full consent between two people, mm -hmm. that they're gonna have sexual relations. With a condom. With a condom. No, because when you... <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on, time We're just talking about, hold on. Si tú me dices a mí, Yo, let's have sex. Okay. Whether I choose to wear one or not, mm. with, with, when, when the, when the so action starts. So she has the right to indicate. No, no of course. No, no. She okay. can be like, listen, wear a condom. Okay. And she, and she said that. And she tells she, you that. Okay. And you, wear, and you wear it. And you wear it. And you start having sex. Boom. Right. And if you take it off now. And you take it off. Okay. I don't think it's considered rape now. It's Why? A di huh? Why not? Again, rape is considered being forced, if I'm not mistaken. Vamos, vamos a Google ya, porque yeah. vamos a Google ya, porque Google tiene... Sex is, is, is... is... Oh, shit, la computadora. Yeah, you have your phone on you. El teléfono de allí. Oh, shit, okay. Está bien. Um, alguien, alguien Google it, alguien Google it. Somebody give me the definition of sex. La definición de rape. rape. Definición. I'm going to come back to that, so make sure to see if I'm right. Dale. So, I personally think the definition of rape is someone not giving full consent to doing a sexual act. Look, two words that you're using. Full consent. consent. Okay. Keep on going. Now, when I speak about full consent, the use of protection, mm -hmm. if she tells you to use it, mm -hmm. and you decide to take it off, you're, disres you're disregarding what was said in, in, in the process. Okay. Ahora, es lo que estaba diciendo. If me and someone are having sex, and from the get, I, I choose to put on a condom and I take it off within the actions, for whatever reason, discomfort, I just don't feel like it. I don't fuck it, oh man, I don't care. That's different. Okay. So, I put this up to vote in my story, right? Okay. Surprisingly, it came out 50 50. Wow. 50 50. Right? That's not a surprise. So, before we started the show, I had the same conversation with a, with a co worker. Mm -hmm. um, and she brought up some valid points. So, rape to me is. Um, when somebody doesn't give you, when, when you violate, uh, uh, fuck, what was the wording? 
When you when you have when you have when you when you violate the uh, no no, it's not rape when you get full consent, mm -hmm. right? But the asunto de full consent, no la, is cuáles fueron las restricciones? Yeah. Le llegaste el flow. El flow. Eh, oye, no estamos sin gas, pero tú tienes que poner un condón. No es la. Normal. Ahora al tú quitártelo, mm -hmm. en la ley, en la ley, en la Rompiste ley. Rompiste el consent. You broke the consent. Flow. Está bien que se acabe. You broke the consent. Mm -hmm. Y al tú romper este consent, tú me entiendes? Ya, you don't have the full consent. Mm. You have half the consent. Tú ves, eso es. Tú me entiendes? So ahora yo, antes de llegar al show, yo estaba muy claro que oye, tú no eres rey, pero eso no puede ser rey, pero no puede ser rey porque yo lo he hecho. Tú me entiendes? Yo le estaba dando una tipo, ah, fuck it all, no, my nigga, fuck it all, my nigga, dale para allá. Yo lo he hecho. Tú me entiendes? Ahora, do I consider it in like my moral values? For it to be considered rape, I do not think so. I do not think so. Mm. Do I think I can violate someone's trust? Yes. Yes. Of course. You know what I mean? Do I think I violated our relationship? Yes. But to take it to the search where it's considered rape, I don't think so. In the moral aspect. Yeah. No me la. Pero cuando se viene la vaina de las leyes. Te rompiendo tu culo porque ya. Manito. No me acaso. No me va a tocar para el dañito. No, no. Suavecito. No, no. Y cuando le digan a ella dentro que estamos por rey, nos van a romper el culito. No, 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 no. Porque así son las cosas del mundo. A flow. ¿Tú me entiendes? No, no. Ahora, do you think it works the other way around? Hell no. Why and why not? Watch me. Girl wears a condom, she takes it off, you fuck. Her. Yes. Explica. Because it's the same thing. What do you mean? It's okay. Really hay muchísima gente que si se equivoca y dice que el hombre normalmente el que viola, si, vamos a decir... No, 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 I'm not saying, I'm not no, saying no. that you can't get raped. No, 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 vamos, vamos But I'm saying the court of law, do you think you have the same pool as a girl does? Digo yo, tú estás supuesto a tener, estás okay. supuesto a tener. ¿Por qué? Si tú estás borracho, desde el momento que tú haces un blaca, una tipa te fu, fu, se te montó arriba, un taca, 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 tú no sabes eso. Te levantaste, la tipa la tuya... Fuck tienen miedo salir a la luz al decir que yo fui violado por una mujer. ¿Tú me entiendes? No, yo, just think about it. Es real, es real. 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 No, porque yo lo digo así para que le vaya más suave a la gente. Exacto. Oye, el momento en que tú dices, la mujer te dice a ti, yo me voy a poner con dos. Dale tu para allá con Super Saiyajin. Dale tu con todos los power. Conviértete en tu suplente. Tu bolu, tu gato, tu baño y dale para allá. Si tú la ves y después ya haces de repente que se está virando un y tú no te diste cuenta. Ya ella está violando el consent también. Claro que sí. Entonces, yo pienso que nosotros estamos en el mismo pool, ¿me entiendes? Claro. Pero ahora llega el flow de la corte. Ese no es el flow, ¿verdad? Yo personalmente pero creo que no. Pero, está supuesto ser igual. Ya dime. I, I, I honestly, I personally think that it's not the same, and that's just my personal opinion. I might be wrong, but yo creo que cuando se trata de, de la palabra rape, when it comes to a female onto a man, the law kind of twists itself a little bit. I why? Why do you say that? Uh to be honest with you, let's 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 let's. I mean, I'm, I'm gonna throw out like a numeric number. Might be t totally wrong. Somebody Google these stats. Um. I want to say maybe 95 out of 100 times when the word rape is involved, it involves a man doing something to a woman. I'm, I'm pretty do sure. You, well, Tom, do you think that has to do with men struggling coming out with declaring yeah. that they're being right. raped by yeah. women? That's right. Of course. So do you think those numbers become biased now? Yes. They, yes, they can. Why? They can. I mean, I can explain, explain. Again, to explain it, it's going to be difficult, to be honest with you, because it's just certain things. As a man... You feel like yo, I I cannot say nothing. Okay, why? So pero, let me pero, give you an example. Going back to a case again, a teacher 
no, no, que ten... takes, takes oh. into consideration, she feels like, yo, este chamaquito me gusta, este negrito está para mí, este es el que yo quiero. Y hace algo contigo. Okay. Tú lo reportas. Quien yo como estudiante, uh -huh. dependiendo de qué curso yo tenga, obviamente. Yo tengo el liceo. 8th grade. 8th grade. Like, I wish. I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I wouldn't, but, pero, yo, pero, pero que, te voy a pero explicar. Pero como hombre, tú no lo reportas, correcto. Pero que no, no, es que, pero, Ahora, que pase pero que cheque, cheque, cheque lo que sucede, checa lo que sucede, checa lo que sucede. Yo, por la persona que yo soy, por el frego que yo soy, ¿tú me entiendes? Por lo interesado en las actividades sexuales que yo soy, yo no lo voy a llamar rey. Yo lo voy a llamar una verduguería. ¿Tú me entiendes? Yo tengo octavo grado y me estoy dando la profesora, ¿qué es lo que? ¿Tú me entiendes? Es el flow mío. Ya. Yeah. ¿Tú me entiendes? Pero otra persona puede decir, yo, I felt molested. I felt like something was done to me that should have not been done to me. So, lo que quiero decir es, es si en la corte tú crees que los hombres y las mujeres van a llevar el mismo flow de los dos lados. Jay, dime. I know. I mean, to explain it will be difficult, but no, I don't think so. Damián. Um, I don't, I don't think so. Just because, like you said before, Men don't come out as much. So when a man comes out, it's like, nigga, stop with the stop bullshit. Shit. You know what I mean? Like, people look at it like, come on, stop with the Like, if you're a kid, if you're in eighth grade and you come out, oh, my teacher did this to me, they would say, crees más. Si, tú eres un muchacho. Muchacho, la diferencia de la. Si, tú eres un hombre, 18 plus, ya te están diciendo, come on, man, you know you wanted to do that. Tú me entiendes? Por la, por, la, por la sociedad, por so, so, la segunda pregunta es, um, it's kind of obvious, no question, I kind of hate it, pero, do you think if men would come out more often as to calling rape, um, situation would be considered a bit more highly than not? Yeah, that's what I was just saying. Yeah. The reason that, that, that they probably wouldn't validate it or would have a pro, like more things to look into is because not a lot of men do. You know what I mean? So if more men will come out, if they are raped, and anybody that's in one situation, in the situation, I'm sorry that we're touching it, and then you're reminded of whatever's going on. I'm sorry. We just putting it out there because it's obviously, important. It, yeah, it's important. Obviously, we want to, we want everything to be equal in the sense of everybody getting this, the, like their rights, their rights. You know what I mean? So if men will come out more. Which is difficult as fuck, even to for women to come out. It's even more difficult for women because they they feel like you think it's more difficult than women than to men. Yeah. Why, why do you think that? Because when when a man, when, even it's more difficult when they know what happened. Because if you do that with not yeah, like things are blurry. Things are not like. But if you te lo hicieron que tú estabas en tus senses y tú te sientes que el hombre te aprieta y tú te sientes como un pienso yo que la mujer se siente como un objeto. Entonces ya se le quita el, le quitan como el, el valor de, el valor de, de humano. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like a human. Because even when kids get raped by men, that, that value was gone. Like in your head, you're like, yo, this guy just destroyed me. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So por eso le digo que es más difícil la situación así. Que un hombre, o que una mujer viera un hombre, then it's like... Uh, and to be honest, I'm not on the other side. I think it's more difficult for men to come out because I feel like I'm not talking about like to come out like in the sense of saying it. I'm saying it's difficult for them to talk about it. No, 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 no exactly. Right. <laughs> then that too, I feel like I feel like it'd be more difficult for men because, um, like we've been touching upon and you know about society and whatnot. I feel like we live, we still live in some sort of a machista world. You know what I mean? And um, I feel like, how do you now walk where you live at? How do you conduct yourself? Saying like, yeah, you know, I'm, I'm saying a girl raped me. You know what I mean? I think that'd be difficult. I think that'd be difficult. I mean, I think the entire situation is difficult for both parties, yeah. honestly. You know what I mean? Um, Such a basis on what you guys are saying. Like, this is a serious topic. Um, and, you know, it's, it's, a, it's a serious matter and it's just happening and not a lot of people are getting informed. Um, and things happen. You know, it's, it's, it's a reality. Before we close the segment, I mean, let's, let's try to close it out on a positive note. Damian, una pregunta que no. me van a hacerte. Uh -huh. Que, why don't you tell everybody about the time you got raped? <laughs> See, like right now, like Yo, to be okay, honest, yeah, if, it, if it was another part of the video and then we were just fucking around, I would answer that like, oh shit, yeah, yeah. But it's not, it's really not funny at the moment, you know what I mean? Because 
It's this happened. shit is serious. It happens a lot. It happens too much. Too much. And to everybody that's seen something weird going on in your dorms, in the street, something that... See something, say if you something. See, exactly. If you see something, say something. 911, go do something. Try to... Something. Sometimes when you do something... Save, it makes some, a save somebody's life because sometimes these rapists be crazy and kill the person or even save their like their whole like in, inner person and then you, they don't go through that um thing so Los haramos con esto. Eh, no chichui, no chichui, no chichui. Eh, remember to subscribe um comment below um leave your thoughts watch the next videos um and nos vemos aquí. yeah and, be safe and if you guys feel a little bit hurt by this and it reminds us of the, again we're sorry. We apologize. We just wanted to put it out there so we have more um, of, a, of, of an awareness. So things that happen to y'all, whoever it happened to, doesn't happen to somebody else. Facts. Facts. Quit out of